Hey guys, it's Frosty here with some more Final Cut Pro 10 tips and tricks for you. Now, the first thing you need to do is load up compressor. Okay, so now you've got compressor loaded, we need to make a preset. Now you just need to have a clip in here just so you can access and customize these presets that are already in the system. So I'm just gonna quickly drag that up to there because I just want it as a 1080p HD video for web uploading. Now I just go up here and select the preset that I've just dropped in and then we need to go along to geometry it'll normally be on summary but go along to geometry and then crop to you want to select Panavision and padding you also want to select Panavision and then you see up here that it's actually showing you the area that it's going to crop then what you want to do is go save as I've already called one Vimeo upload Panavision and then you click save and then you can quit compressor so you go to share add destination and then drag in compressor setting scroll down to custom where I've got Vimeo upload Panavision click OK and I'd already actually had one in there so I've got video upload Panavision and then that's all you need to do quit that and now you'll see in the share panel, you've got the Vimeo upload Panavision. Select that. That's gonna come up with some information if you wanna put that in and click next. It will then continue to export, but here's one I've already made earlier. And as you'll see, it's now created the video in that extra wide, wide screen. Um, and then you can upload that to Vimeo and that will be the size of the screen on your Vimeo. I don't know about YouTube, I haven't done tests with that, but I know this definitely works for Vimeo. So there's another Final Cut Pro X tip and trick for you.